Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on Florida Coasters and today's video is my review of the Thunderation roller coaster at Silver Dollar City. Yep, this is an aerodynamics my coaster. Sorry about that. I'm having sneezing issues lately. So yeah, so this is, this will be my very first negative review ever. So yeah, let's just get right in to the video. Now this roller coaster hoids. It's, it's old, it's an old arrow and it hoids. It kept like banging my head around and it's too long. During the ride, I just like wanted this pain machine to be over. And yep, this is a pain machine. Your neck gets fast around, your head does. And this ride just hurts really badly. If you don't like pain, do not ride this. This ride is painful. This ride is overrated. I'm not necessarily saying like overrated, overrated. This ride is very overrated, and yet it is because people, people actually like this. Like, how the heck do people like this if it hoids? It hoids, it is painful throughout the entire thing. This is basically a trailblazer, but I don't know how the heck many times it's painful. A bunch of times painful. Trailblazer didn't have too much pain in it, but this ride hoids. Go ride the smooth time travel right next to this and not the thunderation. This is a ride to miss out on, and that's for sure. And I can hardly even remember this ride, except you went through a tunnel, there's a lift hill in the middle of the ride. It's not intense at all. It's a boring ride. The layout sucks. It has like one of the voice layouts on a, a roller coaster. It may be a bit beautiful looking a tiny bit, I guess. Other than that, this ride sucks. So overall, I'm giving this roller coaster a D rating. Yep, this is the first time I've had to give a something on my channel a review this bad. This roller coaster is really bad and painful as well. So that's why I'm giving this one a D a D rating. So yep. Anyway, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See ya. And this is my Racer New York shorts too. Anyway, see ya.